Welcome everyone to my preview of my game, which is going by the uh, working title of Realm. It's an ad action adventure game of sorts. Well, not so much. It's not so much action as the combat is sort of turn-based. Anyway, this is the uh, opening screen. It's not a title screen as such, but this is where you end up when you load this the game as it stands. And you'll notice it's an ASCII game written 100% basic. I'm after seeing Dragoman, Peter Vino's Dragoman. I thought ASCII games are the way to go for me. Well, well they'll do what I, I want to do. Uh, you'll notice then I just picked up a health potion, so down by my potions uh, stats screen down here. Um, I've got a potion there. My attack went up by one because I picked up a plus one sword. Go over to this chest and I'll find it contains a hamburger. Well, I'll take that and I'll put it into slot one. I know I have a hamburger. Moving across, I'll pick up the green key, and that will allow me to come and go through these doors, which uh, I wouldn't have been able to unless I get had the key. All right, all right. So here's a quest. I've lost something dear to me. If you could find it, I would be so very grateful. Have you seen my straw doll? I will trade you a blues harp. Well, I want a blues harp, I suppose. Um... I'll give him the hamburger. No, that's not it. He wanted a straw doll. All right, don't worry. I'll try and find that for you, mate. No problems. All right. Moving along. I guess we'll go straight down here and get ready for our first fight. Now the combat is um, my next port of call, really, for this game because I broke this system of combat. Uh, some months ago, and I haven't done any work on it since, but it was sort of a placeholder, and it kind of works. That guy just got obliterated. You'll see his stats show up there. That was just the debug feature that I wrote for myself at the time. All right, uh, I'll come down and collect this gold. This is the most gold that you can pick up in a... Uh, chest and you'll notice the gravity there so he found tried to run across there no but you can get across up there and back up and back up to the next screen that way um, I think I might come across and beat hopefully beat this guy he is quite powerful that guy look he's doing some damage to me Ooh. He's defeated, but he uh, took a fair amount of health off me. There we go, I'll get, here we are in this weird screen. I'm not going to go up and beat that guy at the moment. He might do for me at the moment. Uh, this loads five screens. Um, all from a text file. That's a memory limitation of... Uh, well that was a memory limitation that I hit early on because I tried to load everything into its own unique array I tried to have 10 screens and a bunch of stuff and I found that 5 is what sort of has given me enough room to work with but bring on the uh, full memory access for BBC Basic um, come on Dean alright that this guy wants a straw doll item well I can give him the hamburger all right and wonderful now I can go back and see old mate just gonna bowl three screens oh, yeah, there's sort of a title screen of sorts this guy's really hard to beat this one actually it says here this monster can be hard to kill it has a high speed stat if you have a healing potion press p to use it all right you drink a health potion and hopefully my health stat goes up to 14. now i can go and beat this guy now this guy is hard to kill 
Oof. Oh no, I did. I did all right. My attack was enough to uh, fend them off. We'll go back this way. Back in our home castle. An old mate here. Here's a straw doll. Press I to give item, and I'll give him item number one. And he gave me a blues harp. Wonderful. So now I can do quests. Um, those NPCs, you can buy things from, or they will just uh, give advice. Anyway, thanks for watching my game, and I uh, hope when it comes out in a few months, you will download it and give it a go. Thank you.